So, Dr. Krisha Baltar. Thank you, thank you, partner Russell. So, I'll be presenting to you the a testimony of a liver liver cirrhosis patient. Okay. So, actually, <laughs> she is my mother-in-law. So, this was during her first CT scan at St. Paul's, St. Paul's Hospital in Tacloban. Uh, this was last uh, June 30, June 30 lang this year, 2021. So, look at this one. Um, ito yung findings. Ito yung first, find, uh, first result, no? Uh, with her, I know, with her um, CT scan kasi she undergone two CT scan. So this was last, nito lang ha, nitong June 30 lang, 2021. So sabi ng first CT scan niya, meron siyang liver. I don't know how should I read it. <laughs> Basta liver disease, yan. Okay, then uh, she also undergone AFP. Uh, laboratory, the alpha fetoprotein. So when I search what alpha fetoprotein is, it says that um, AFP level between 10 ng um, nanogram per milliliter to 20 is normal for adults. So um, dito sa result, there is IU, so I also search its international unit. Its equivalent is for one nan nanogram, it's equivalent to 0.83. So basically, ang laki talaga ng, ano, laki talaga ng um, AFP result ng mother-in-law ko. It's really greater than 400. So if it is greater than 400, it could be a sign. Take note ha, it could be a sign of liver tumors. And then it says also that high levels of AFP may mean other cancers, including so meron pag ibang mga diseases. So yan yung findings niya sa AFP. And then it was also advised by her doctor to uh, do a second CT scan kasi they were looking for which colors daw, which color dun sa liver yung meron talagang maraming bukol. So it resulted to a liver cirrhosis. So uh, um, yung liver damages kasi pag umabot na siya sa liver cirrhosis talagang ano na siya, medyo um, grabe na yung damage niya. So it, it, it leads basically to a cancer na. So yun yung sabi ng doctor, no cancerous na talaga siya. So she she was advised basically to have a chemotherapy. Since ayun niya dun sa process ng chemotherapy, so hindi na siya nag-undergo ng biopsy kasi sabi ng doctor ayun naman ng patient, so we will not um do the biopsy na. So parang they were basically hopeless to know, hopeless na talaga. So I said, why not try this one, the Sante Barley? I just knew Sante Barley this year lang, no? I was actually, it was introduced to me by partner Russell last year, but I was hesitant kasi nga, I, I was not really a user of organic product. So it was really difficult for me because it really, it, it is really expensive. Yes, it's really expensive, no? But, but then... There was no, there was no other ways. There was no medicine. There was no medicine um, uh, suggested by, ano, prescribed by the doctor, no? Kasi sabi nga mag -chemo na eh. So, no medicine at all. So, sabi ko, let's try the, the organic. Let's go back to the basic. So, since there's no other way, wala din siyang magawa. So, she has to try. She has to try the, the, the Sante Barley. So, yun. She started... She started drinking the, the Santi Barley juice. What we did, we mixed the daily C, yung vitamin C. Uh, yung ginawa namin is uh, three scoops per drinking, ha? not per day, per drinking. So, kada inom niya, meron siyang three scoops of barley juice and then three capsules of daily C. So, although yung, yung cup ng daily C is a VG cup, we still ano, take away the, ano, the, the, the ano, para madali lang kasi ayaw na niyan ng mga anything that um, yung nilulunok. So, ayaw, ayaw na niya ng mga ganun kasi ang dami na talaga na niyang iniinom prior to this. Uh, she was actually diagnosed with myoma last May. 
Siguro hindi talaga ata yun mayoma, but then meron siyang tinake na mga gamot, so medyo nawala. So finally, medyo talaga hindi na kaya ng katawan niya, nag-second na naman siya, nagkasakit na naman siya by June, yun na yun. Yun pala, meron talaga siyang liver cirrhosis. So anyway, yeah, nag-start siya ha, July 10. Imagine July 10 that uh, today is the exact second week, the exact second week of um, drinking barley juice. Yun yung ginagawa niya. Um, six times a day siya umiinom. Morning, and then snacks, and then lunch, and then snacks again in the afternoon and their dinner before uh, she sleep, no? So yun yung ginagawa niya, umiinom siya. And then today, my husband went to their uh, house, no? So binisita niya, sabi ko, you take pictures of nanay. So yan, sa so, eto, this one, ito yung ano talaga, July 24 laboratory checkup niya. Yan talagang, eto, binasa ko sa internet, bakit ano, nagsiswell yung paa at siya ka malaki yung tiyan niya. Doon, sabi naman ni ano, ni Google, <laughs> ano talaga siya, effect siya ng liver cirrhosis. May mga ano siya, parang, um, yung effect ng sakit is, nagsiswell yung paa, eto o. Oh. To yung, ano, and then lumalaki yung chan. Um, in, in other words is that, um, in other words, maraming tubig yung chan niya. Ayan. So after two weeks of taking barley, ito na yung paan niya. Actually, she cannot stand on her own. Even sa paghiga, pagbangon, hindi niya kayang bumangon mag-isa. She has always someone, yung, yung kapatid, yun yung tumutulong niya pag bumabangon siya. At saka hindi niya talaga kaya mag-walk alone no, before. And then um, ngayon, kaya na niyang bumangon, kaya niya niyang maglakad. Yun, yun yung improvement niya. And hindi na masyado, hindi naman totally nawala. Meron pa din, pero hindi na ganun kalaki yung maga ng paa. And also dito sa ano niya, oh, sabi niya kaya daw siya nakakalakad, it's because hindi na nagsuswell yung paa. So that's the improvement basically. And also the appetite, no? she has already the appetite. So meron na siyang ganang kumain. And then since um, yung ano naman talaga, barley talaga is naglulusan talaga ng weight. So basically talaga into healthy healthy um, body weight yung barley, yung effect niya. So, medyo nag-ano siya, bumaba talaga yung timbang niya. Okay, so that's it. We thank God for His goodness. Kasi walang gamot, wala ha? Wala talagang gamot. Purely sante barley. Meron namang prescription, just ano, um, pain reliever lang. Kasi sabi ng doktor, pag sumasakit yung siyan, meron siyang buskupan. It's a pain reliever lang, di ba? So we continue to pray for her total healing talaga. Sana mawala na yung liver cirrhosis niya. And we will continue to spread. So that's basically one of the reasons why I really joined the company is to really spread the benefits of Sante Barley. No? It's not just for, for partnership in business, but also really to advocate um, health, no? to advocate uh, this kind of um, advocacy, no, really, ano, um, push me forward to do like this kind of activity. So, yeah, and then, yeah, that's it. Thank you. <laughs> Back to you, partner Raz.